All right, guys. You know how sometimes, as a parent, you buy something for your kid, but in reality, it's for you? This is one of those times. So we've officially made this Taika's room because we felt like the other room, the one that you guys saw over here, which has already turned into instant storage, was too small. So yes, it's instantly storage, and we felt like it was too removed from the family. Like this is the hallway, right? Where everything happens. And um, we feel like when you come in from where everything happens, you gotta come all the way down this hallway to finally get to Taika. And we feel like he's too removed from the action. So we want him to be in the action. So originally this room, which was saved for our another guest, we're like, dude, I think the ceiling's even taller than here. See, you see that? How there's no extra window on top of that window. But over here, you have that and that. So I think that might be like a 10 foot ceiling. I think it's like a 12 foot ceiling. It looks really tall. So, because we have such a sick room to start with, me and Mom were brainstorming. Okay, so obviously he's not gonna have his grown up ass, weird blue velvet bed, right? We're like, what would be a sick ass bed for Taika that he would have a blast on? and we started looking and we found this bunk bed so i grew up with a bunk bed even though i didn't need one i don't have any brothers and sisters but it's freaking cuny as hell and we found a sick ass bunk bed uh that also has a slide on it so it's like a built-in playground and now when his homies or if his cousins come over they have a place to stay and that's why i'm saying i think i'm more excited than he is because it's like when I was a kid, and if you were to ask me if my dream come true, I've always wanted a tree house. And this is as close as you're gonna get to having a tree house in your room. So, see you later, bunk bed, or blue bed. So what do we do? So now is the time where I, uh, we make a second baby, you know what I'm saying? Uh. Cause the type of stuff that I'm down to do, the turn monitor on, is pretty nuts. So I'm pretty handy around these parts of town. And anytime I'm handy like this, and I start messing with the nuts and bolts. Mama oh, bear gets freaky. Nuts and bolts? And mama bear's nuts and bolts get crazy, huh? It gets freaky freaky. I'm so good. Wow, so strong. Just like that sound? Just like that sound? Yeah, yeah, just like that. So, for all of you guys who aren't as manly as me, the way this socket wrench works and why it's so awesome is once you lock it into place, it'll go on one side, but then it cranks this side, which is why it's so much easier than pliers for all you non manly men like me. Bam, so take that apart. Wow, yeah. so strong, wow. No, see how fast I took this apart? Wow. Exactly. You know I saying? just know how it works because I put this bed together all by myself. No, you didn't. No, I totally you did. Don't even say that. Don't even say that. All right, so we completely disassembled the bed, as you can see. Dun, da, da, da. So now, we cleared out some space in this Taika storage room to put that bed right here. I don't know if that's gonna fit. Um, and to be honest, what we should have done is actually organize a storage room so we have more room for storage. But both me and Mom Bear are so freaking excited to build that bed that we're like, let's just start working on that room first. So hopefully we have enough space, because if not, we're gonna have to take all of that stuff off and disassemble this bed so that we have more room, but I hope- You keep saying we like you do anything here. You, everyone just saw me turn you on. Is that why your nipples are popping up? <gasps> They're totally not. You wish. <laughs> I know, I do wish. Wow, look at this handy lady. 13. You about to talk shit, boy? Nope. Look at him. Look at him. She knows what she's doing. You yeah, know what she's I doing. I got a fucking desk from Amazon. Yep. <clears throat> and I got so far. And then to find out the whole thing was like backwards. Oh my God. And it was this same setup where it was like, everything was numbered, which I was like, thank you God, it's numbered. <clears throat> Do you even know what you're doing? Yeah, I'm just putting it in order. Okay. You talking shit? No, just checking. I'm talking yeah. shit because you know I won't do anything because you're holding a camera, huh? Nope. Sure. I don't know if this is a nine or a six. 
but we'll find out, right? I mean, it's pretty easy to tell. Tell me then, you son of a bitch. So, look at that. It's right there. Look at that right there. Makes perfect sense. This three or thirty. You you serious? You've seen a 30 like this before? <coughs> well, this one's 30. Exactly. So doesn't that answer all of your questions? You're a fucking asshole. You're a fucking Six or nine? Oh, this one's I hope six. you poke your eye out with that piece of wood. Wow, you're so fucking rude. <laughs> Just kidding. You're so fucking rude. So that is box one of five. This is box well, two of five. I was really looking for the directions. Yeah. But it is also good for just opening it in chronologics. Yeah. Don't look down my shirt. <laughs> I'm not. I'm looking at your big back. Oh, thank you. Yeah, you've been working on those little lats, little I'm baby so lats. I like how you call them big back and you still took it away from me. It's kind of good. Uh -uh. Baby lats. Yeah, they're cute. Cute little baby lats. Is it on your side? Yep. 30 or 36. 36, you said. So, this is a lot of individual pieces. This is going to be a pain in the ass to put together. No, it's not. We, we, we got this. You sure about that? God damn it. What the fuck? What happened? What number is this? 33. So long. Why? I believe in this. All right, cool. 38. Shout outs to Universal Kids Furniture. Not a brand deal or anything, but they're from Vegas. Just wanted to shout them out. And they're local. yeah, they're local. The guy that delivered it was so cute. Like he dropped it off at our doorstep and he was like, hey guys, just wanna let you guys know, thank you so much for supporting. He didn't even know who we were. They're just like, thank you so much for supporting. We're just a brand new company just trying to start things back up and um, and are just trying to start things up. And so it's so cool to like have you guys order. And I was like, dude, like we were on the website and you know, when we were trying to get a well, high- I thought it was sketch. I thought it was sketch. Why do you think it was sketch? I don't know, because there's so many like companies that show you a picture of one item and then you buy it and it's like the super cheap version of that thing. And you're like, fuck. Yeah, AKA Alibaba style. Yeah, yeah. I didn't want to call them out, but yeah. Yeah, and um, but when I was looking through the description, like what made me believe in them was a lot of like kids' furniture is made out of like NDF wood or particle wood, which is like not very strong. And when you got a rambunctious kid like Taika, who's gonna test the limits of everything, we're like, dude, if we're gonna get a bed, a bunk bed that has a slide on it, it better be strong, you know. So when I looked at it, I was like, what? Solid wood? That's dope. They barely make furniture out of solid wood anymore. And usually when they do, they're crazy expensive. This was actually still affordable. So I was like, let's order. And it was cool that they ended yeah, up being these local. Types of bunk beds, this style I was looking, average were like two, three grand. I was like, the fuck? Yeah. This one was 9,000. I mean. <laughs> Damn, baller. <laughs> fuck, 100, $900. So yeah. it's two beds for one, that's pretty good. I can also see why though, because you gotta build literally every single part. Hey, I might as well cut. To save a thousand dollars. I might as well there. cut the tree down myself. You know what I'm saying? Hit. Hey. Oh, Damn! Bitch. Look at those baby lats going to work. Stop. So this is what the finished product looks like. You see how cuny this is, and why me and Marbert love this so much. You got the queen size bed right here. And then you got the twin size bed right here, and you got the little nook, and then you can slide down. Oh my god, this is a dream come true. Look at that. This motherfucker just told me this. Repeat what you just said. So I said that uh, the directions are probably in this box because which a is the last box. So there's a, a tape that says hardware sticking out, um, and usually they keep the hardware with the instructions. Why did you wait until all of this? I mean, it was eventually going to happen. I just didn't want it to be in this order. I wanted to start building. You know what they're just saying what? in Spanish? What? Um, but I'll say it in English. Mi the lazy. De la bruja. Chinga tu madre is one of them. That's not the one I'm talking about. The yeah, one I'm talking about is how you chinga her yourself. <laughs> the one I'm talking about is <clears throat> the lazy guy works twice. 
Oh. <coughs> the fuck does that mean, Hopper? <clears throat> yeah. That if you just did it right the first time, you only have to do it once. I am doing it right the first time. What are you talking about? I'm making you put everything in the right order. You fucking... Holy shit. Well, at least I appreciate them that it came this way because my desk that I got from Amazon that I'm returning now because it was all fucked up. Everything was just in a little bag. At least this right here is like like very organized. So I do appreciate that. It's already counted for me. For the Amazon one, I had to count everything by hand because I'm like, I'm not about to build this and then I'm missing like two of these and then I'm super fucked. So I have to count everything first. What? So the first step that I do, because I'm such a pro handyman. No one cares. Okay, here, here you go. What, wait till like w you have all the answers. So you're gonna be like, oh, I need this special like bolt, but I'm gonna use all the other ones and go through them first and then go, oh yeah, I had to use this one. Is that what you're gonna do? This is called a screw. Whatever the fuck. I don't need to know. I hired your dumb ass. This is a screw. And I just look for the exact drill bit that has this and this and we can work fast. Your mom. And look who woke up from a nap. Take him away. <laughs> I come on like a baby. You know what this guy started saying? He started saying, bruh. Hey. Bruh. Hey, Taika. Bruh. <laughs> oh my god, it sounds too natural when he it says it. It sounds really good. We sound old when we say When he it. says it, it sounds like. Bruh. But also sounds like, oh man, this kid's getting old. He's learning all these slangs. Bruh. Take it easy, bruh. But I still like when he says, Cunie Pie. Taika, do you still say Cunie Pie? Bruh. Oh no! So this is why it's super helpful. A lot of IKEA furniture and a lot of like build at home furniture, they actually use Allen key like this. And if you were to crank all day, especially something with a million pieces like this, it's a pain in the butt. So I've built enough IKEA furniture to know that. So when I started buying um, drill bits, I would specifically buy ones that have like an Allen key. So now you can install way faster. And I actually learned this because uh, back in the day when we bought IKEA furniture, I had one of those professional guys build it. And it, w it would take me like eight hours to build one couch. You remember that one time where like these three dudes came? Yeah, they're in? like, brr, brr, yeah, they brr. built like six things in two hours. And I was like, oh, that's the secret. So it's important to have this guy. And also, don't set it on the max. Because I've also done it where it just drills right through the wood and splits everything apart. So I always test the like personality of the wood. So I started off at like two and then I'll like stop as the like that. And then on this material, I realized like 12 is pretty good where it doesn't feel like it's going like, to obliterate it. But then when I kept it at two, it was too soft. So you always want to take it easy first. What happened? You farted and I hate you. <laughs> <laughs> here's the one over there. Anyways, here's an update. Looking pretty good. It's interesting because they have you build the top first. So that's the top bunk where you put the twin size bed and it lays perpendicular to the queen size bed. I don't know if it's really the top. We don't know it is the top. It looks like the top because the twin is up, up top. And there's this one part. I think we kind of messed up. I'm not sure if they messed up, but we have a casualty. But most importantly, I just want to make sure that Taika's safe. So all the locking mechanisms are super in place. So they're really, really tight, including this one right here. Even though it's broken on this side, but look, look at that. So, hey monkey, are you excited about your bed? <laughs> you cutie. Look at your bed. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> We're almost Is this done. Cool or what? There's gonna be a slide too. Yeah, you're gonna get a slide down. Let's find out. <laughs> okay, so we didn't quite finish. We've been working on it for how many hours? Maybe from six, four hours? Four hours, okay? Literally every single screw that you see, we probably put in hundreds, literally hundreds of screws. 
we're down to the last wire but you know for Taika seizures and stuff we need him to sleep early so we don't want to keep working into the night so Taika is sleeping on the top bunk which is freaking comfy and cute <laughs> me look how cutie this is look at, look at this guy you be cutie is it look comfy mister and you got little monkeys with them um, it feels comfy oh it's sturdy too look at that oh, except for, uh oh except for this part we need to work on this i didn't tighten this oh no yeah I'll, I'll tighten that but then yeah i just gotta knock this part out what look look at there's cracks i know there's and there's one right here get okay, it <laughs> i put my stuff hey cool can yeah grandma gave that to him and i can reach cutie pie i can see it in the window it's cutie pie and it's glass Good night, mister. Bye.